Ladies and gentlemen, in today's episode on CCSC, we are going to build this entire residential area over here. All self-sufficient buildings, high density commercial, a little bit of uh, high density residential, all of this in our toxically polluted area as of right now. Let's go ahead, get into the episode, see how we complete this. Thank you for joining us here at CCSC. Please like, share, and subscribe. And also, we're going to do this entire peninsula here. So, a lot to talk about in today's episode. The very first thing that we're going to tackle is the land that we have terraformed over here. We're going to go ahead and level all this out. Now this is going to take quite a few years of in-game in time to raise the money and actually be able to do this. So we're going to go ahead and do this off camera. So we're going to go ahead and hit play. We'll just run this at one time speed for right now. And off camera we're going to do a lot of terraforming. We're going to go to our landscaping tool over here. Level terrain. And I was looking at this a little bit earlier, and I think we're going to level it to about this height back here. Uh, we're going to level all of this down and some of it up to about that height. And if you go to our terrain height tool, you can see we have a lot of land over here on the edge that we could probably build up if we do it slowly and carefully. And we could take back and reclaim a lot more land. So we might proceed with some re land reclamation as well in this episode. But let's go ahead, go off screen, I'll start building this and we'll meet you here in a minute. And welcome back. We have finally finished our beautiful peninsula over here. Uh, we have filled in quite a bit of land that we've reclaimed from the bottom of the sea. Uh, we've added a seawall all around the exterior of the peninsula. Uh, as you saw in the, well, let's call them low lights, uh, we did have some flooding problems over here in our residential area. That's all right. Um, we managed not to lose any houses. Nothing went abandoned. Everything cleared up in time. So, you know. It's all right. Uh, we, we've got this peninsula that I'm very excited about building on. However, I do think we're going to save this for the next episode. But in the rest of today's episode, we're going to go ahead and satisfy our residential needs just by clearing this area over here. We're going to move our industry, as we've talked about in many episodes. We're finally going to clear this out, and we're going to move this trash dump to the other side of town. We're going to put this over here by our power resources. Uh, and get that out of the way and we can f fulfill our residential need just by filling in Hillside Square and we'll call it an episode. We've now completed our Hillside Hills area over here and we went ahead and changed the entire area into a self-sufficient area. So all the houses that were there got torn down and rebuilt. Uh, we also added quite a few things. So all of this is self-sufficient housing. We added some office zoning over here on the edge. All of these back properties back here are all office buildings. Uh, so there's a few places for employment so people don't even have to leave Hillside Hills. Uh, we've got a tennis court, basketball court, tennis court. Um, we've got a playground. All of these residential areas for low density here in the middle. And then we've got a few high density residential areas just on the end. Just a few apartment buildings right across from the office buildings. Um, kind of add a little bit of depth to it. And I really like the way this area looks because of that. There's a little bit of depth behind the bu big buildings uh, with the small self-sufficient low density residential housing um, as a kind of a backdrop. I think it looks really good. I like this area. Uh, all of this is high density office uh, in the back and then all around it is uh, high density um, commercial buildings. So all of these are commercial buildings for high density. So we've got a lot of commercial down here. We added a park. Uh, we kind of filled in the area with a little bit of beautification, just added some trees all around the entire area. We moved this little traffic loop up to this corner here uh, and added a few trees, a few rocks, just something to make it stand out, make it look a little bit nicer, and especially because that's what you're going to see as you pass along the highway. I think that looks really good the way it is, and I'm happy about that. Um, so all the corners are all residential, or sorry, um, are all commercial. 
Uh, we've got a few low density, just small mom and pop shops here uh, on this main strip. A uh, few low density, mostly high density. Uh, we've added a lot of park paths all around that people seem to be taking advantage of. Even this back alley, which I didn't know if they would use or not. I zoned off this area right here uh, with a park path just because I want a little reminder that I want to put a subway stop there. So that's just a placeholder for right now. Um, I really like the way this area turned out, and we've exceeded our residential needs. We're now at 11,500 population. Uh, we're doing fantastic in the game. Uh, very happy with this little residential area. Very happy with this peninsula that we've built over here. Can't wait to get into that. And uh, can't wait to play the new DLC in the next episode. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much for joining us here at CCSC. Please like, share, and subscribe. And as always, we'll see you next time.